I wanted to show you how we can trace whether our career life is stressful according to chart in Vedic Astrology. Because different planetary positions in the chart will define various career life opportunities. Especially in the Navamsha and in the Nershamsa, we will have a special options to choose from. If we have some negative yoga related to those positions, then we may reconsider that options because this may not be the best for us. First, we check if in the chart there is a negative connotation or relation between the career life and uh, some inauspicious yoga, and especially if they are related to the health. And if it's there, then we can find which exact career life options or paths indicated by Navamsha and Dashamsa are leading to those bad or inauspicious occurrences. And then we can decide if we will leave that opportunity because it will negatively influence our uh, life or health. Then can be different situation in life, either the relationship with the boss or with the colleagues is stressful or the nature of job also may not be the best. Sometimes this is the finances and this uh, strain also put a lot of uh, negative impact on our uh, health, especially the mental health. Uh, this case is quite extreme, but uh, we can apply all those rules to our charts and see if and which lines are negatively impact, and then we can make the informed choice. We will see how it's important to have a good knowledge of yoga formation, because we may have a knowledge about the houses, plants and signs, but if we don't know how to connect them to a yoga, then we can miss an important piece of information. I want to highlight two important yoga formation. One is the Uchanat. So if planet is an own sign or exalted, we say it gives the results on very high dimension or levels. And he employs another planet to give the results for this, our earthy living. And who is that planet which is hired for the job? It's the Lord of Exaltation. So to make it practical, if you have, for example, Jupiter in own sign or exalted, this effects of that planet will be given to moon because Jupiter exalts in Cancer, and Cancer is loaded by the Moon. And we do the same for all other planets. The other important yoga formation is Trikona. So if you have, for example, planet in Aries, then those in Leo and Sagittarius will have very strong impact on the planet in Aries. So to be able to use it, you need to have some basic information about the tent lord in the Rashi, about Karaka level. So we see tent house from the Moon. Then we are using the Arudha level. You need to understand how to calculate the Arudhas because this will show how the things manifest in life. And then, of course, the Varga chart. We will use the Navamsha chart of fortune. All areas are there to analyze the Shamsa chart of career and Trimshamsa, the chart of health. This person is quite extreme because he sacrificed his life. He discovered in 2003 February the SARS virus in Vietnam when he was working within the project doctors without borders, but we can use these extreme examples to analyze how our career life can make us stressful or have other negative impact on our health using the same principles, but here just the level will be extreme. So the SARS virus, those uh, diseases which will impact the lung and our breathing system are defined by Rahu and Mars. So first we are analyzing the main chart. Tent house is for the career life and the Dushtana is showing the health problems. Six and eight for diseases and 12 house for uh, recovery like hospitals. So we need the connection between tent, those Dushtana and the yoga Rahu and Mars. Here Mercury is in the own sign so it's Uchanata, a Rahu needs to be analyzed and Rahu is in the 12th house and it's involved in the Parivartana or exchange with the Mars. Why? Because Mars is in the Rahu sign and Rahu is in the Mars sign. Additionally, there is a second Parivartana between Saturn and Mars. This is not better because this yoga between the planets Saturn and Mars, it's called in Vedic astrology the Yama Yoga or the Yoga of Death. So because it's related to bad houses, 12th and 3rd house, this is negative. So we have this connection between career life and some inauspicious things related to health. Second level, Karaka. Here, we need to analyze especially the tent house from the moon. And exactly as in the previous level, it is Saturn connected to the same yoga. So there is nothing additional to say here, but we got confirmation that it's not only some one time project which got involved in that negative things 
of 12 house, but it's rather the full career life within the person is operating. Let's see what is happening on the next level, Aruda. Here we are analyzing the first house or the house of Aruda because that will define our career life, our color in society and category we belong to. And for the death, we need to see third and eighth. So we have seen that the Mars is aspecting the Mercury, but this is only one way yoga, it's not enough. But Mercury again, is an own sign, so its results given to Rahu, and Rahu and Mars have this Parivartana. So we can accentuate and appreciate how this Parivartana between Rahu and Mars is playing function on many levels. Also on the Aruda, it is connecting the Kree life, because first from Aruda Lagna is connected to Mars, and first from Aruda is connected to Mercury here, giving effects to Rahu. And we know that this is the exact points which we should be looking at because the demise of the person was exactly in Mars, Mercury, Mercury. Also on this level, the Rahu and Mars yoga is related to these points. But will this happen to all people which are born within these two hours? Definitely not. You will see that you will have two people with the same chart, but their life will be totally different. Therefore, we need to employ the Varga charts. So now we will start with the Navamsha chart or chart of fortune. And just like Rashi, it has all areas of life. Therefore, it's like second Rashi chart. And here we are looking again at yoga or connection between the career, which is 10th house, and the demise or health problems, the 12th house. So remember, if you have this yoga in your chart, it doesn't mean that you will die because of work, but it will definitely have bad impact on our health. Therefore, we you can use those yogas to choose and make the informed choice. So now again, without knowledge of the principle of the Uchanat, we're not able to make that connection. Why? Because 12th Lord is Mars and it's an own sign. So the only connection to the 10th house is through Saturn, because Mars is exalted in Saturnal sign Capricorn. Therefore, if you have Mars in own sign, it will give effects of whatever Saturn is saying. And Saturn is intent with Rahu. Rahu shows research. It's in the Mercurial sign. Mercury is a Bishak or doctor of the chart. So therefore he got the money because it's 10th house from research related to medicine. And also viruses are related to Rahu and Ketu. But because it's related to the 12th house, we have this connection of career life and bad health or in extreme situation like here, the demise. Now we have two more charts, Dashamsa and Trimshamsa. In the Dashamsa chart, now it is very interesting how to see that. First of all, we see that in the Shamsa, the moon, which is showing the health or how the person is feeling, is in the eighth house. So moon in eight is Marana Karakastana. So the whole Kree life will be also colored by that. And then the Lagna, which is showing the health or uh, living in Kree life, is very much under the influence of malefics. We need Saturn for disease. We have also Mars, which is eight lord and of Kree in twelve. And we have malefic in second. These 12 and 2nd, this is causing a very high affliction of Kartari Yoga on the Ascendant. This can totally stop or break the career life of the person. And because Saturn is there and also Mars and Rahu again, we have this yoga, this is due to disease. It's also worth research that death is not shown by Saturn, by Mars. And Eight Lord, which is ending the career life, is the Mars itself. And just to get the, another confirmation that we are looking at the proper points, this all happened in the Dasha of Mars. Now the final point. How to see that this will be the career life in the Trim Shamsa? We need to employ the Karaka Mercury because the Mercury is the main Karaka of the 10th house. Now, if it's connected to the points of death in the Trim Shamsa, then we need to be careful because it can be quite serious. We have Mercury in the 12th. And here we need to employ another yoga formation, the Trikona. Mars and Rahu are in Trikona to that Mercury. And this demise happened in Dasha of Mars, Mercury. Mercury is in the 12th. So we got confirmation also from this chart of health. Person would be born few minutes before or after. This chart would be totally different. The timing of death will be different. Also the cause will be different. So with different Navamsha, Dashamsa and Trimshamsa, this will be 
totally different story, even if the Rashi will have the same positions. Because my father was teaching in his career life the mechanical engineering. I remember he was always giving that example, which is very proper for understanding these levels in Vedic astrology. When you are looking at cylinder and sphere from the top, both will appear as the circle. But you need to get another perspective from the side to be able to differentiate is it the cylinder or is it the sphere. Similarly, from the Rashi chart, many options are there, but you need to look from the side to be able to differentiate between these various scenarios. Okay, guys, so that's it for today. If you'd like to help me, please don't forget to thumbs up and also subscribe. If you'd like to uh, discuss Vedic Astrology, then join our Discord community. If you'd like to learn Jyotish in a very structured way, we have a course which you can join. We have 60 hours of Jyotish knowledge with many, many examples. And if you'd like to have personal consultation, then please hit me up with this email here. And if you'd like to learn about the Shamsa chart analysis, please consider watching this video here.